For 30, there was a special dedication ceremony in Tiger today. A veteran who lost both his legs and right arm in Afghanistan was able to see his new home made just for him and his family. It wasn't just an ordinary day for Sergeant First Class Wade Mitchell Tree and his family. Ladies and gentlemen, it looks like they're arriving. Today, they were honored in the city of Tiger by the Gary Sinise Foundation with a brand new smart home. As he carefully walked up to the podium during the dedication ceremony this morning, an emotional crowd clearly seeing what he endured to protect his country. Wade was severely injured by an improvised explosive device. The many donors who helped make this smart home possible right. believe it's the least they could do for an American hero. I hope this home gives you the independence that you deserve while making your daily life so much easier for you and your family. Welcome home, sir. The veteran will need some time getting used to his new home. There we go. Let's get hit in the right spot. Everything is built with an amputee struggle in mind. Many things can be controlled by this iPad. It's it's mind blowing. Is it too good to be true? Uh, that's putting it lightly. Yeah. <laughs> Mitchell Tree says this is his favorite part of the house. Yep. Shower. Hands down, I can't wait to get in that shower. Reminding us of all the little things we take for granted. Really, I didn't really do anything. I just put my foot in the wrong spot. Now, this home was given by the Gary Sinise Foundation, and it's for the nation's most severely wounded veterans.